let's talk about customary measurement. I have several friends that are going to help us today. Meet Rowdy the Ruler. Hey guys, I'm Rowdy the Ruler. Let's talk about length. Length measures how long or tall something is. We can measure length using the inch, the foot, which is 12 inches as you can see from our ruler, or we can measure length using yards. Yards is three rulers put together. A yard is three feet or 36 inches. Now let's practice with length. What customary unit would you use to measure the length of the pencil? Hmm, would you use the inch, the foot, or the yard? If you said inches, you are correct. Now, about how long is that pencil? We can measure by looking at our ruler. If you said four and a half inches, you are correct. Now for capacity, I have my friend, Marty the Milk Jug. Meet Marty. Hey guys, let's talk about capacity. Capacity measures the amount of liquid in a container. We can measure capacity using the cup, pint, quart, or my favorite, the big gallon. Let's practice. Which customary unit of measurement is used to measure how much milk is in a glass? Hmm, here's our glass of milk, my favorite. If you say cup, you are correct. Which customary unit would you use to measure the amount of lemonade in a pitcher? If you say quart, you are correct. Good job. Now meet my friend, Sammy the Scale. Hey guys, my name is Sammy. Let's talk about weight. Weight measures how much something weighs. We measure weight using ounces and pounds. Let's talk about the difference. Ounces are about the weight of a feather. Have you ever heard the saying light as a feather? Because a feather doesn't weigh very much. Next we have the pound. The pound is about as heavy as a loaf of bread. Let's do some practice. Which customary unit of measurement is used to measure how much a person weighs? Er, a big strong man. If you said pounds, that is right. Which customary unit of measurement is used to measure how much a pin weighs? If you said ounces, you are correct because a pin doesn't weigh very much. Now let's practice some different types of problems. Josie's desk is 24 inches long. There are 12 inches in a foot. How many feet long is Josie's desk? There's Josie working hard at her desk like I know that you boys and girls are. We have a ruler which we know is 12 inches and that is equal to one foot. And we have another ruler that makes 24 inches which is another foot. So two feet long is the length of Josie's desk. Jeremy filled his water jug with two gallons of water. There are four quarts in a gallon. How many quarts did Jeremy need to fill his water jug? Hmm, let's think about this. We have a big water jug, and we know that there are four quarts in each of our gallons. So if I have four quarts in one gallon and four quarts in another gallon, what is my total amount of quarts? If you said eight quarts, you are correct. You guys did a really good job today, and thanks to my friends, Rowdy the Ruler, Marty the Milk Jug, and Sammy the Scale 